It's a John solid. Mom! Didn't I tell you not to go outside without my permission? Don't touch me! Who are you? I'm your daughter! I'm Yasuria. I quit my job last year and became a housewife so I can take care of my mother. I'm tired. My husband is working all the time. I'm at my limit with all the housework and nursing, but... I know it's a little while away, but my mom has agreed to go on a short stay for a month. Just one more week of hard work, and I should finally be able to relax. But my hopes were short-lived. Yes? Hello? Oh, from work. What? My husband collapsed? We suspect he was a stroke due to exhaustion from overworking. Can you come to the hospital where he was taken? Yes, understood. Although my husband's co-worker called an ambulance right away, which saved his life, he hasn't woken up for a week since then. <sighs> if you don't wake up like this, what am I going to do? Even if I go home, I'll be stuck with my mother who has dementia. I'm exhausted. Katsura, please wake up. Yes, sorry, I saw it. Uh, um, Azumi-san? Yes, I thought you forgot about me. She's Azumi-san. We used to be co-workers. But we weren't very close back then, so I don't really know her, to be honest. Since you left, everyone misses you, Yasuria-san. Is your mother still in the hospital? No, I'm looking after her at home. My husband had a stroke recently. Oh no! Our boss is actually hospitalized right now as well. He'll be fine though. Oh no. Well, that's a light way to put it. Are you free later? Um, no, sorry. I have to get back to my mother after I go shop for some groceries. Is that so? But she'll be going to a nursery home tomorrow for a month. I think I'll finally be able to relax. That's good. Let's go for some lunch then. I know some good places. Um, I'm not really in the mood for. Oh, it'll be fine. What's your number? See you later. Good luck with your mother. Looking forward to next time. <sighs> I don't know her. She kind of forced me to have lunch with her. Is this okay? Considering what happened to Katsura? Three days later, I met up with Azumi-san at a restaurant she reserved and ate lunch. This hamburger steak is delicious. Right? It's my favorite. I haven't had much of an appetite lately, so I wasn't sure if I could eat today. But it's delicious. I'm glad. I know so many great places to eat. Leave it to me! Do you eat out often? We hardly do because it gets quite expensive. I guess if you and your husband both work, it makes it a lot easier. Huh? <laughs> I'm single! Plus, I've been saving up for a while, you know? Money is all I got! A luxurious single life! Uh, I'm sorry. I completely thought you were married, judging from your vibe. I get that a lot. I grew up with a single mother, and since I don't have good memories of my father, I have no desire to get married. Regardless, it does get lonely at times. So, if we could hang out from time to time, I would be very glad. Yes, you're right. I'd be happy to. And I meant that, because I had a good time for the first time in a while. I can't even remember the last time I had a laugh. But after getting home... <sighs> It gets lonely being home alone. Having said that... She won't stop texting me. I got things to do. I'm not even interested in idol groups. What? A call? Texting is hard, so I called you instead. Um, yeah, is it something urgent? Want to join me on a one-day bus tour to see the cherry blossoms in Takato? There's a room for two that's open next Tuesday. What? I'll reserve it if you come. I'm sorry. I don't think I can go anywhere for a while. If it's just one day, shouldn't it be fine? Your mother's staying somewhere else, right? My husband is still in a coma. Right. That's unfortunate. Well, we'll go for lunch soon then. See you soon. Uh, 
Azumi-san continued texting me for a while, inviting me for lunch, movies, and even shopping. Katsura. Even after that, Azumi-san wouldn't stop texting me, but I stopped replying. A week later... Doctor! When will my husband wake up? I can't say with certainty, but it's not entirely out of the realm of possibility. Does that mean... Let's also think about what happens after your husband regains consciousness, because he may have subsequent complications. You're kidding! What? Ah, uh, Yatsuria san, I'm relieved! I was worried since you didn't reply. I was busy. That's why I called! <sighs> There's a new cafe and their cakes are really good. Would you like to go? I've got a lot on my plate. Really? Oh, have you watched the drama series? I told you already, I don't have time! Yes, good job. You don't have to try so hard to be nice. Block. That's it. Back to normal. I am back to being alone. <laughs> so stupid. Huh? From the hospital? I'm sorry for calling even though you just left. N no Is it my husband? Your husband regained consciousness just now. Katsura! Yuzuriha? Thank God! I couldn't have imagined what I would do without you! <laughs> I'm sorry I made you worry. But the doctor said it might take a while before I fully recover, which means I can't go back to work. I know I'm going to be putting you through a lot. I'm sorry. Stop apologizing and get that out of your mind. What matters is you're still here. That's all I can ask for. The fact that my husband regained consciousness did a lot to heal my battered heart. I was busier than before now that my husband started rehab, but seeing him get better every day gave me a source of power. I was feeling better every day. But there was something on my mind. A few days ago, I got a call from a different co-worker from the company I used to work for. Long time, Kari. Are you still working for that company? Yeah, I haven't changed. By the way, I wanted to ask you something. Do you remember ozmi san Huh? Y yeah I do. Apparently she quit her job all of a sudden, and ever since then, no one can reach her. You don't know anything, right? I mean, you two were never that close anyway. Y yeah I don't know, sorry. ozmi san missing. Is it my fault? Should I unblock her and give her a call? But if she doesn't pick up, I... No, it's too scary. Six months later, I need to go grocery shopping for tonight's dinner. My husband recovered from rehab and returned to work. My mother hasn't changed, but she is doing well with no major illnesses. I'm gonna go get some groceries. Azumi-san, on the other hand, was still missing. If Azumi-san never turns up, I'm taking what we had in the past all the way to the grave. Azumi-san or I, whoever is to blame, I will have to live with this regret for the rest of my life. That is my reparation. Oh, Yasuria-san. Been a while. What? Didn't think I would see you here. Wait, it must be a dream. I've been exhausted lately. You're kidding! She thinks of a hallucination! Calm down, it's me. I know you probably didn't want to see me, but if you have time to spare, would you like to chat in a cafe nearby? You were having a six-month trip overseas? Traveling is not always such a luxury. Staying at nice hotels and eating good food every day. Even I couldn't afford that. I just went there to reflect. Reflect? Soon after you blocked me, my mother passed away and I was completely alone. I was faced with the sadness of how it feels to lose a family member for the first time. All alone busy with funerals and other things that come along, I finally understood what you were going through. I genuinely felt for you, and I invited you here and there to help take your mind off things. But once I realized it was making things harder for you, I was heartbroken. Azumi san. That's when I decided to go overseas. I quit my job and terminated my phone contract. I wanted to change myself, so I went from country to country following nothing but my intuition. 
And as I gazed at the sky balloons in Cappadocia, I thought to myself, what a small world I've been living in. All the way to Turkey. I felt like a new person and also had a feeling I could start over with you. So I returned and then I ran into you. I thought it was fate for a second. Yes, Uriah son, I'm very sorry for giving you such a hard time. If you can't forgive me, we don't have to be friends. I just always wanted to apologize. I just wanted to tell you I was able to change a little bit. Hazumi san, no, I'm the one that needs to apologize. When I heard you were missing, I thought, what if it was my fault? I was so worried. Wait, missing? That's what people are saying? Yes, everyone was worried about you. Th that is my fault. I don't think anyone would care. Please, use this. Thanks. Thank God you came back. Thank God. With Azumi san back, it felt like everything went back to how it was. You're going to the movies, right? Have fun. Yeah, see you later. Since then, Azumi san and I continued to see each other while keeping a healthy distance. Sorry, did I make you wait? It's fine. Shall we go then? If I were to give our relationship a name, it would be Friends. ご視聴いただきありがとうございました。コメント欄に書いていただけると嬉しいです。また少しでもいい話だなと思った方、チャンネル登録と高評価をお願いいたします。